Greetings and salutations, my fellow Entropians. Guys, what I'm going to be doing today is the Camp Crunk Cloth Crate Key instance here at Camp Crunk. The Camp Crunk Key Cloth Crate thing. It's true. Alright, so here, here we go. We have one Camp Crunk Cloth Crate Key. Um, at full TT value, it is very, very necessary to get this all the way up to full TT value because I am sure it affects the loot at the end of the instance. Now, here is some information for you. If you would go down to the des description of the video below, I will have the website for the Shield Core, which is this right here. This little website right here. And it will have all the information that you p could possibly need to run this instance and here at this camp crunk stall we have crate keys like right here um now keep in mind these things take uh quite a bit of money to craft for the owner which is shadow the unicate soul right here um so it's not really sold on the market too much it's mostly sold at the stall and uh, him himself right there now you can get like a bunch of camp crunk cloth crate keys and other interesting things such as shield crates that will drop at the end you build those up and get those um and you can turn them in for fabulous prizes and stuff like that we're going to go check out this entire instance right here right now and hopefully it's going to be completely awesome now keep in mind on the website and uh you you can actually get a package deal for different various prices you got gold prices and stuff like that so you're getting like 10 keys for like 560 pet i believe and you can get that right from shadow the unicate soul and here we go we're going to take our camp crunk cloth crate key to enter the camp crunk cloth crate and there he is right there this wonderful guy so make sure you message him if you want to go in especially if you're going to buy a package deal going to be fantastic and let's just go on in now today we are going to be using all right yes i wish to proceed these are the droids i'm looking for all right so we have this is a timed event right here and uh as you can see we got the timer right there and uh <clears throat> today we're going to be using ghost with no plates because well i got other other things and you can definitely go with something really low, like maybe maybe like a, a TT weapon or something like that. But we're going to be using something along the lines of, oh my god, they're all over the place. So we're going to be using our Markarkalis 4. And just FYI, you don't get any loot until the end. So just go ahead and work on getting all these guys taken out as quick as you can't wait. Maybe that's not the case. Wait, oh, I guess he didn't loot anything. That's that's cool. That's cool. He he was sparkling like he he was. Like, look, he's sparkling. Look at that. But I think we get all the loot at the end. So maybe we should probably buy like uh, a what you would call it, one of those loot collection things, just to make sure. I don't I don't know. It's, it seems to be like something we might actually need. So the Mulholland boys and all this stuff, and this is Camp Crunk Cloth Crate. Yeah, we're we're gonna we're gonna buy a loot pill just just in case. I know I usually don't do this very often. Wait, where where is it? Loot collection pill. I just want one. Thank you. Stop shooting at me. I don't like it. Our oh oh wait, that's not a weapon. All right, there we go. <laughs> all right, so like I said. Um, here is a place, it's an instance, a solo instance, so only you can really come in here, guys. But the items that you get at the end are actually very high markup, and this is probably the only places to get something called Speed Metal, which is very useful in crafting. Uh, everybody needs the Speed Metal and whatnot. So it is actually within the realms of something that you might actually want to look into getting. Uh, just for the speed battle alone, but there are other things that drop and we're going to see exactly what we get now Just keep in mind. We probably invested a good uh, Repairing the key it, The TT value of the key is like 80 PD. So that's like eight dollars 
And plus, uh, it's like four dollars to buy the keys and whatnot. But we got ten for 560 PD. So we're gonna see if that's actually a pretty good loot at the end and stuff like that. Now I think it is timed, and because there are such events that you can find on the website down in the description below, um, I guess the more times you run it uh, and make sure that you share your score with. Uh, the Unicate, uh, you will be able to get some rewards at the end and stuff like that. So it, it is kind of interesting how he has set that up, to be completely honest. Um, whoa, okay. And I'm like really kind of freaking out just a little bit because, well, these things really can't hurt me or anything like that. And we're just trying to do the fastest speed run that we possibly can because I really want to see what's at the end of it. Now I don't know. Uh, there is apparently. Uh, let's 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 see. I got I got to look. Uh, all right. So the silver pack for the keys is like ten at five sixty. Now they got a gold pack for twenty five keys, which is one thousand three hundred and fifty. And uh, the Crunkster pack, because you know it's Camp Crunk. Uh, it's fifty five or yeah fifty three keys I think or fifty five. I, I, I can't tell. It's two hundred and eighty two thousand eight hundred and fifty Project Entropia dollars. So it is something that you might want to look into doing as sort of like a part of, uh, I guess if you want to flex on them noobs and stuff, you definitely get a whole bunch of keys and, and do what you got to do. Um, but hopefully in the end of all the runs that you could possibly do, you can actually end up getting a good TT loot value in return, or at least some high markup items. Uh, nonetheless, I'm interested. Like, you have no idea how interested I am in this. And if you actually manage to get a top score, all you got to do is just report it. And I'm pretty sure it's going to be like visible to everybody uh, exactly how high the score is at the end. And you can actually manage to get on the leaderboards as well. So that's something to look forward to. If that's kind of your thing. You know, you want to be better than everyone else, or at least compete, you know, the competition being better than, you know, the, the vast majority. But, you know, that it's not always about that. Sometimes, like, to, for me, honestly, it's about the loot. It's about the content. Um, I really would actually, if everything goes very well, I, I would want to encourage people to do this, but... I also want to make sure you guys understand that the risk versus the rewards. Um, there's always risk and there always are rewards. But maybe, just maybe, the rewards might come through a little bit of a grind. Trust me on this. And sometimes that is actually the case with most things. But because it's a player event, it's an event made by another player, um, and they have such good rewards such as the shield stuff, the shield drops in the, the exchange shop. Let's see. I'm trying to look on the website right now. The event, the event challenge, the shield crate collect event. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and... Oh, jeez, they're all over the place. All right, so if you collect 100 shield crates, which I know that you probably don't get a lot, you'll get 100 ped. If you collect 500 shield crates, you'll get 750 p PD, okay? Uh, 1,000 shield crates, you get 2,000 Project Entropia dollars. And 10k shield crates, you'll get 25,000 Project Entropia dollars. So, guys, honestly, like, it's mostly because the owner of this instance, which is the Unicate, he is basically offering good rewards for those that grind in his instance. And sometimes the rewards that we're going to see that what we get at the end might might actually come out to being really good in and of itself. But there's extra rewards. So that being said, like the more you grind this out, the, the better you're going to be in the long run, in, in my personal opinion. So that's something to think about. If, if you have the means to do so, try to see if you can't do it like that. But, of course, you can also buy keys individually at the stall out there, just so you can grind out on your own accord. Or you can, you know, get hooked up with some package deals and stuff like that, which is always going to be cheaper. So, that being said, there, there, there you go. And, 
Man, I'm telling you, these these guys are just everywhere, and they they, they just want to keep swinging on me with melee weapons. <sighs> they can't they can't mess with this. You know why? Because we are amazing. I know, I know. It is so true. Let's see. What else can I tell you about this little website now? Um, like I said, you got the King of the Dungeon, which is, I guess, the Camp Crunk Croft. Oh God, Camp Crunk Cloth Crate Dungeon King, Danka Sol Nidu, uh, two times, and I guess he gets the King's Treasure of 160 Project Entropia dollars. Now, uh, there is no King for 2018. So, it's only for 2017, so keep that in mind. Um, there is an active event going on right now, so... You might actually win something for being the king. I don't, I don't know. The lower price on packages. Ooh, that actually sounds pretty good. Uh, become the king of the dungeon player. It needs to have the largest amount of claimed rewards in a certain dungeon. So if you want to be the king, you got you got to get a lot of rewards. Jeez, these guys are just swarming on me. And uh, like I said, the king of the dungeon for 2017 is Dank Sol Nidu, and there is no king for this year, this current year. And that's actually kind of kind of sad because I want to be the king. It's good to be the king. It it always is. Uh, actual treasure, ooh, it will be claimed one. Oh. Okay. But, yeah, like I said, you might want to go ahead and check out this website. on uh, Just down below, check it out. And come down to uh, Camp Crunk and get a Camp Crunk Cloth Crate Key. So you can do the Camp Camp Cloth Crate. Uh, camp Crunk Cloth Crate. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And whoever can actually say Camp Crunk Cloth Crate Key five times fast without messing it up you, you will also win a prize I'm just, just gonna FYI that for you like for real that is a tongue twister and a half so well I, okay you might not win a prize but I, I'm telling you you really should if you if you can just say that five times fast without messing it up because I haven't been able to camp crunk cloth crate key camp crunk crunk I'm just gonna stop all right, so I don't know how much longer this is. I, I know it's not too very long, honestly, but I'm having I'm having a blast just going through these guys, just mindlessly killing. Come on, go down. All right, I th I think this is the last one in this pack. I wonder what what we're gonna come to next. It looks like there's even more. Now I would actually recommend trying to go after all of them. I don't I don't know. I've never done this before, but I think because of the fact that, you know, all the loot is rewarded at the end, I think the the more you kill the better the rewards. I I would assume. But it, we'll find out. I mean, I just I really just don't know. It seems kind of interesting. I'm really anxious to see what this is all about now it seems that there is a lot of time on the timer for all of this so we'll, we'll see but yeah definitely you can come in here because these are only level twos you can come in here with not that much firepower like i'm definitely doing a little bit of overkill on these things i'm not gonna lie three shots a piece is is a little bit too too much Honestly, it's a little bit too much. So, but it is one of my my limited weapons, and hopefully we're getting enough skills right now. I don't know. Yeah, it looks like we are getting some good skills. But the creature did not carry any loot. The creature did not carry any loot. Oh my god, he likes to dodge. So, that being said, we're going to have to see exactly what we get at the end. That being said... There's another one? Why is there always another one? But from what I understand, it takes only about 30 PDs to go through this. Uh, 30, 30 PDs worth of ammo, that is. So 
keep keep that in mind. Make sure you bring enough to do the instance in and of itself. Make sure you repair the camp crunk cloth crate key all the way to full TT uh, because most of the time, whenever you buy it, it's, it's going to be uh, not full TT. So make sure you get those repaired. But if you buy any extras, make sure you throw those into the storage facility. Oh, it looks like I think we're done. All right, here we go. We got a Tax Elite MK1 and 44 PEDs of shrapnel. Oh my god, that was 62 PEDs worth of Attack Elite MK. Wow, holy smokes. Oh, examined cargo container and Camp Crunk cloth crate key. And, or wait, not, not key, but the cloth crate. Oh, jeez. And found something of 106 PEDs. Not too shabby. And here we got all the damage inflicted. Creatures killed, 76. Um, damage received, there's, uh, damage received. We only received 10 damage, nice. Number of critical hits, 10. So you get all sorts of stuff. And, uh, yeah, all this stuff. All of it, all of it. So like I said, you make sure that you come out here and get all this stuff. And it's just going to be great. Now, I don't think we got any shield crates or anything like that. But we did get a pretty good loot drop. A hundred and... So I think we actually came out on top of on this, honestly. Like 80... Yeah. Like 30 ped up or so. Which I think is kind of interesting. What was this weapon? I'm really interested. Alright, the tax elite. And it is... Oh my word. I can... It's a... What? I could use oh my god I got a weapon I can use and it's oh I love this wow this is not going to be sold this is going to be used by me oh my god I got uh, I got an awesome weapon guys well I, I hope you've enjoyed this I'm using this weapon by the way it's, it is my level I think I think this camp crunk cloth crate is a good thing it has given me an awesome weapon that i can actually use oh my god yeah this is this is really within my all right that's enough that's enough thank you for watching thank you for listening please like share and subscribe check out the information down below and join in on this this is actually pretty good and we got something we can actually use oh my god till next time Peace out.